This weekend, officials are growing increasingly concerned in Wayne County as cases are growing in Gross Point. Victor Williams is live in Gross Point Park tonight with more on what may be to blame. Victor? Yeah, guys, I mean, it seemed like the curve was finally starting to flatten, but they have confirmed that more cases are now coming over in Wayne County, more specifically in the Gross Point areas, all because of a party, potentially. Everybody was feeling good about the situation, I think. And then on Wednesday, we had two more cases. There's apparently a new wave of COVID-19, and the Wayne County Health Department says that there are a few dozen recent cases making its way through the Gross Point communities in the recent days. And then on uh, Friday, we had 12 more, more cases. So that was a 25% increase in our cases uh, just in one day. In the last four days, we've gone from 48 cases to 68 cases. Thankfully, there are no fatalities, but Councilwoman Amy Fluitt says that she's heard rumors spreading throughout the area of a massive party featuring a college student who was unknowingly affected with the virus. We have a lot of uh, parents talking to each other. We have a lot of people talking on Facebook and speculating. And that, that seems to be the prevailing theory, but that has not been confirmed as far as I know. And there's a chance that same person could have also gone to a popular restaurant, Harper's in East Lansing, potentially leaving another trail of the virus, possibly infecting others. It's believed that so many are letting their guard down when it comes to taking precautions on contracting the virus. And that's one of the reasons why Councilwoman Fluitt believes that more bad news may be in store for the state. I think we're going to have to shut down again. Um, that's just my opinion, but I think that's that's where we're headed. Now, once again, this whole party is all speculation, but we just wanted to inform everyone because we have received countless phone calls and emails from parents all throughout the Gross Point area. So once again, that is the reason why we are doing this story. Reporting live in Gross Point, Victor Williams, Local 4.